You use AEC tools to create objects such as walls, doors, windows, and stairs, among others. AEC tools are equally useful in 3ds Max design and in 3ds Max. When working with AEC tools, it is best to work by layer. This is the default in 3ds Max design, but has to be set manually in 3ds Max. This can be done in the Preferences dialog, or by choosing the design settings in the custom UI and default switcher. To start, you usually work from a reference such as a blueprint or a 2D CAD drawing. It helps if the reference is simplified. In the case of a 2D CAD drawing, turn off the layers not required to build 3D models. To work with a degree of precision, enable snap mode and set it to vertex. To create 3D walls, first make sure the walls layer is current. You can then use the wall tool and set its width to 1 foot and height to 10 feet, which are the specifications of the outer walls. You also need to set the wall justification. If you set it to left, the cursor will be at the left of the wall as you draw it. Going from one point to the next, you can now easily build the outer wall. After you close the loop, you can right click to exit. To create another wall, click the wall button again, otherwise any changes to the parameters will affect the already created wall. The interior walls are 5 inches wide and 9 feet high. You can create them with the left justification as you did earlier with the outer walls. One advantage to using wall objects is that a gap is automatically created as you add doors and windows. Set the walls layers properties to see-through mode. This will make it easier to place the doors and windows. On the doors and windows layer, Add a sliding door to the kitchen outer wall. Doors and windows are created with a click and drag by specifying the width first, depth second, and height third. In this case, width and depth are specified with the help of snap tools, but the height needs to be set to 7 feet. Notice the automatic creation of the gap. This can be better seen by opening the patio door. Add a pivot door to the bathroom. Once the pivot door is created, you can flip the hinge, reverse its swing direction, make it a double door, etc. In some cases, the creation of the gap is not always successful. If this happens, delete the door and try again. Sometimes reversing the creation process, left, right, can solve the problem.
Windows are created much the same way, although they typically start higher up from the floor. After you create a window that's lying on the ground, you can change its parameters normally. Once this is done, you can use the Move tool to translate the window on its Z-axis. The next AEC tool we'll take a look at is the stairs tool.